spot. Why are you looking at me like that? Is, is it going to make any difference if I pick it up or not? Well, yes, but what is it that we don't care? Let's talk about two different sites, who cares and who doesn't. There's something about this that we'll talk about later, but for now, let's go back to the ones who don't care. There may be different reasons. They don't visualize the magnitude of the problem, they think it would not matter if they do something or not, or they have the habit of always going through the easy way. And by caring about something, they think that they take the responsibility for acting. And that requires effort, right? But now, what about the people who say they care but are not doing anything? Maybe a person yesterday was posting on Instagram that we must care about the planet, and today he left the stove on, and while he was putting stove in his hands, he left the faucet open. Or like me, who says that yesterday I was on an environmental talk which interested me a lot, and however, I am throwing plastic bottles into the ground as if the bottle was going to fly into the trash can. Why, if we say that we care, we continue like this? Why, if we're aware how the planet is? Why, if we want there to be a change? Perhaps, like those who do not care, it is hard to believe that only with us we can make a difference. But, for example, if we collect one bottle per day, we collect 365 bottles in a year. And you may be wondering, what is that comparing with the millions of bottles thrown in a, thrown in a week? But although 365 it seems like a small number, it is an important one because perhaps one of those bottles will end the life of an aquatic being. So we not only pick a bottle, we save a life. Every action has its reaction, and also it means that we are starting to act. Unfortunately, we share a kind of belief with the ones on the other side. That whether you do something or not, it will not make no difference. But how can you be so sure if you haven't even tried? We must bear in mind that it is useless to support environmental care if we remain sitting on a couch doing nothing. But sometimes it's more the comfort of the routine than the same interest in change. I mean, what would I have to, uh, to carry my own bag to the supermarket when they can give me one there? Or what if I should decrease the time of TV when I can watch my, some chapters in my favorite series? And please, we all know that the few chapters that we are talking about end up with a whole season. We tend to hope for a miracle, for the planet to just be safe for itself. We tend to believe that with time, everything will be solved. You have to be clear about something. Things can change over time, but they will not resolve for themselves. Things can change for the worse or for the better, and that depends on us. Time can change many things, but if, you, but if we are together, we can make even more changes at the time itself. But don't forget, time is wise. We need to align with it. No, no, that at one time, time continued changing and we don't. And we were stuck in a world that now is not sure if it has unlimited or limited time. Now, talking about time, some people are always saying is that we are waiting in search for solutions. The solutions are already there. What is not there is so desire and the decision to change words into actions. We only left with a hopefully or what if, what is, uh, and at this time, I will ask you, and what if we try? What I'm going to tell you, let's try it. Normally, they tell us the opposite. But now, I tell you to not just think, act, inspire, not just stay looking, go alone sometime, not against it. It's go far beyond the comfort means that it is inviting us day by day. As well as your subconscious, the planet is also spreading more for you and more for us as a community and citizens. It is time that all those words that have been said to us since we were kids, turn off the lights, don't be three hours in the shower, collect as more garbage as you can from the street, we decide to value and make it part of our lifestyle. Actually, this is my second tech scandal talk, and I didn't know what to talk about because I wanted to emphasize the attitude of the people. And this came to my mind because I am one of those who can talk about much, of, uh, talk about climate change and all of that, but I really don't agree 100%. And I told myself that just like me, there are many people. And like me, from time to time, you have to get out of that comfort zone. Be ready for the change. Yes, they tell us that we must do things for people, I think also for the planet, because it is our home. It gives us life. So where are we taking that? Where are we taking life away from it? The change that I'm asking you, I know that it can be a little hard. But if we have hope that we can make a difference, we'll be ready to try it. I hope bring actions, and actions bring fruits, isn't it?
But we can say that the actions that we make also bring hope. Today, I am deciding to care. Today, I am deciding to make my own difference. Thank you.